All right, guys, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. I cannot thank you enough. All the support, each and every part. You guys beat me to my own videos and drop likes and everything. Just really, really awesome. I don't feel like doing a swan dive for the intro. I don't think you can. I'm going to risk it, though. All right, guys, I love you. You want multiple parts each day? Just keep it up. And let's get this. I'm going to try. Here we go. Hey, he kind of did something. It's more like a toothpick. All right, let's do this, guys. Here we go. That's actually kind of unexpected. All right, take the moonshine to Rhodes uh, Saloon. I finally sold those Cornwall bonds. Got close to a thousand for them. I wanted more, but not bad considering how hot they were, especially after that bloodbath in Valentine. No, not bad at all. Apparently, Cornwall's been pumping a lot of cash into the Pinkertons. Wants to keep their full effort on going after gangs. Gangs like us. Yeah, that don't surprise me. All right, this could get ugly. You and Dutch already have that thing going on in town with the sheriff. Yeah, Mr. Gray. That's it. Now we're inserting ourselves in his blood feud. We'll need some. I ain't playing dressing. You know how I feel about that. Of course you're not. You're, you're a clown's idiot. Brother. Hosea, please. I'm the clown. You're the idiot. Just look sad and keep quiet. Even you can do that, Arthur. Oh, I have to. Uh, put this hat on. <coughs> Smoke this pipe. Bring your lip forward. Just a bit. Squint. Oh, perfect. Uh, what about you? Oh, shh. Sh you can't speak. You're turned idiot. <laughs> right? Broke poor mammy's heart. Uh, there, there. Fenton, there, there. Don't get mad now. Oh, shit. Like this, uh... This can only end one way. <laughs> Us versus the sheriff probably won. Like, that's just, uh, like, the route this little chapter seems to be going. Okay, Fenton, stay calm now. For Mama, she loved you so. <laughs> just a shame you had to strangle her in a rage, right? Grab two cases of that stuff and follow me. <laughs> All right, collect the moonshot from the back of the wagon. All right, we're good. Can't carry all of it, but I'll try. Gentlemen! Gentlemen! Quite the town you have here. We just rode in from up north. Hey. Hello! Hello, I'm Melvin. This is my brother Fenton. Don't mind him. Don't madden him. He's turned idiot. <laughs> Killed our mother, but it weren't his fault. How'd you boys... How'd you boys like a couple of bucks? I bet you would. One for each of you. We're in the new trade of advertising, which is an American art form about ensuring people buy the correct things. I don't know. One more dollar. Says give us half an hour. What harm can we do in half an hour? <laughs> Go along now. Enjoy the money. Come along, Fenton. Let's hand out the liquor. This has to be one of the best open-world story-driven games I've ever played. Gentlemen! Gentlemen! My name is Melvin. That's my brother Fenton. He's a bit funny, but boy, can he pour drinks fast. For the next 30 minutes, the drinks in this year bar, in this year town, are entirely free! Yeah. The only rule is that you gotta drink them. So hurry up, put old Fenton to work. Don't get him mad, though. His mama made him mad, and we buried her. The whole thing. Ah. Now come up to the bar, everybody. Come on, fellas. It's your lucky day. I'll have one, Fenton. Raise glass, Come raise bottle. Bounty. It's a sin to look a gift horse in the mouth. When I see a gift horse, I know. Alright, sir, drink. I poured a lot into that little thing. That's some strong stuff. 
Just keep them coming. Don't drink up. Don't be shy, boys. <laughs> Mr. Gray won't be happy about this. Ben, grab another bottle. Honey, don't be shy. This is kind of a random mission. This almost reminds me of the woman Lenny. Just a little bit. Seems longer than 30 minutes. Everybody's lit now. Oh my goodness. The lit montage part two. Hey, send a couple this way, will ya? Hey, keep it coming. These souls need some joy. Oh, wife is gonna kill me. <laughs> The hole went out for milk. Come on, Ben. People are dying of thirst over here. I just had a bad idea. What if that stuff was actually poisonous? And we just killed like this entire town. Just keep them coming. That'd be a crazy twist. <laughs> drink up, drink. The Moine Raiders. Good evening, gentlemen. Quiet libation. You, me. You're the bastards who stole the liquor we was gonna buy. Jump. We're in advertising. Uh, come on in and have a drink. That's our goddamn lick. An honest mistake. Boys, get him. Oh, Are you kidding? Shit. For you. We oh. run the lick around. For you. <laughs> be cool if I could. Oh, man, his eye. Get upstairs. Like the Terminator in this bitch. Uh, items almost out. Chewing tobacco. Get that dead eye going. Alright, let's go upstairs. We run the liquor around here. Stay the hell out. Arthur, help! Oh, he needs help. Nice! 50%. Let's go, man. Hey, hey! It's this way! God. Oh god, I got hit right there. That's gonna take away from the gold, I bet. Well done. Let's go. <laughs> oh my god, what in the world? <laughs> nice. Come on, Brandon. Hello. The old wrist alley oop. I'm getting this out of here. Ain't gonna let this go, are they? How you like coming up against the Raiders? Over there! They got out the back! <gasps> got more coming! Bastards! Ah. Hi, this Arthur, coming out of the... Uh, Dead Eye's almost out again. It actually is out. Never mind. Arthur in front of us now. How convenient. For you. Or for your friend. Ah, oh, missed that. But hey, it counted. I'll take it. There's more to your right. Like both shooting. Holy shit! I see it! Oh, made it! In front of me! Well, it's essentially a setup. Oh, this person is not gonna do anything. Are we good? Chewing tobacco. The moonshine! Yo, I didn't think about that. They hit the moonshine like that. think so wasn't too bad there's no way that mission could be timed because I don't know I reckon it's more they don't want another gang on their patch need to get my need to get my cores back to normal uh let's see Health core, here we go. 
There we go. All right. We're good. Yeah. Remind me never to take up a career in... What was it? Advertise. Yeah. You think that woman set us up? No, I don't think so. Maybe. This place is odd. Well, I keep seeing those fellas. Some local militia. Clearly not too happy to have some new competition. I'll go visit old Mob Braithwaite, see what's what. Why? We've been making money. The chest is filling up again, slowly but surely. Part of me thinks we just get ourselves good and lost. But we still need a lot more money before that can happen. So, for now, let me go give old Mrs. Braithwaite some of this moonshine as, well, let's call it a peace offering. Sure. That was fun, Fenton. We'll make an actor of you yet. <laughs> I'll go speak to Dutch. So, what do you think? About what? The fine folks around these parts. Oh, real nice. Exactly. On the one side, we have got the Gray family. Scots, degenerates, drunkards, the local law. You couldn't make this stuff up. Rich as Croesus. And on the other, their mortal enemies, the Braithwaites. Moonshiners, hypocritical, both rolling, we believe. In gold. Mm. And in the middle of it all, you got some inbred retailing of Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so what you boys thinking? We try to rob them both. You sure? Why not? Because we got lawmen in three different states after us. Last thing I want is to get us into trouble, but we need money. Now, we have the opportunity here to put ourselves in the middle of something ain't nobody gonna know we was here. Because even without us, these fools are gonna kill each other okay, anyway. Okay, well, Hosea's gone back to see that Braithway woman. Good. Hosea should definitely take the lead on this. I sent Sean over to Braithwaite Manor, too. Now, you can meet up with them, or join John and Javier at the Gray's place. Something to do with the Braithwaite's prize horses. Well, how the hell did we get an in at the Gray's place? Sheriff Gray kindly put in a word with his father. It ain't that complicated. <laughs> we gotta convince each family that we're on their side, and then we rob them both. Before they figure out it was us that done it, and not the other lot, we'll be long gone. Think of it as payback for my daddy. Payback. I ain't in the revenge business, Dutch. Least of all for something happened a long time ago. Well, I guess we all gotta pay for something. Now, if you will excuse me, Arthur, I got to write a letter. Interesting. All right, advertising. Uh, let me see what the actual thing would have said. So the exact same thing. Headshot 5, 90%. I thought my accuracy was pretty good. I bet it was like in the 80s. Alright, uh, we got two more missions that just popped up. So what I may do here... Let me see if there's any more upgrades I can do for the camp really quick. Maybe go get some ammo. I'm gonna go ahead and send out restocks for everything. I thought for a minute we were gonna be, like, moving. <laughs> uh, I don't need to put too much in here. I have items I can give. Let me go drop this one silver emblem ring. We don't really need that much money in there right now. So I'll just hang on to this and might get into a high stakes poker game later on. Who, who even knows, really? That would be nuts. Somebody donated a bracelet. Okay. Uh, we can do restock. Okay, yeah. Can you do more after the 60 or does it stay at 60? Okay. Uh, Alright, purchase that as well. Ammunition. We don't have anything else we can upgrade. Like, it's completely, like, maxed out right now. Yeah, that's it. That's everything. Alright, I guess on that note, uh, the next two missions I know we have... The one that popped up way over... Where's it at? Oh, it's down here. Never mind. Yeah, because we had, uh... John Mar Yeah, you know what? I feel like we need to continue with this one first, because that's kind of going along what we're actually doing. So I may sleep till probably like the morning. 
So give me guys, or give me just like a minute, guys. <laughs> I can't speak. It's already over. I should probably go get some food really quick. Let me go over and see if the stew's ready. My my goal was to initially max out the entire camp area first. Mind if I sit a minute? Everything seems to be kind of in order, though. Like, I, I feel like we're making a pretty good dent in this story. But at the same time, the fact that it only shows, like... I'm kind of hoping that it's more one of those things where it's like, Hey, you're 30% done. But, you know, there's actually a, uh... That's just, like, exploring and stuff. You could finish it with, like, 60% done or something. You want to join us, Arthur? <laughs> I like blue water. Mm-hmm. Black water? You can keep that. <laughs> blue water. Fire water. These guys are drunk, man. <laughs> Black water's for fools. Go to this icon over here. I haven't really been over this thing in a while. It's the one where you, uh... Natural. Take canned man. salami and stuff. Take candy. Ain't natural at all. Get your cores right. Haven't really done that much. I don't want to take much. One thing and I'm good. Alright, time to sleep. Give me a minute, guys. Alright, it's a brand new day. Went ahead and uh, took a nap. Gonna go ahead and continue with the story. I went through everything, kind of... Grabbed some bullets, grabbed some medicine, stuff like that. Stuff for the horse, clean the horse, clean my guns. <laughs> as best as I could. Dutch is here waiting, so here we go. What now? You sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. We're in Magicians some disease for sport. Oh, no. Dixie whistling shithole. <laughs> uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. Well, not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. All right, go to Charles. Here we go. So I got some good news. We're 30% done with the game. A little over 30%, almost 31. Charles, I need you for some business in town. Come on. Okay. Got the average clothes on. You know, the temperature seems right. I'll say this, there's a lot of stuff to really do in this game. There's, I would almost say there's too much to do sometimes. Cause, you know, you get back and it's almost like you got chores. You know, you gotta take care of your horse, you gotta eat. Otherwise your character will get underway. So, where are we going? Dutch wants us to have a talk with Trelawney. About these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hey, wait up. Yo, he's so far away I kinda took off it. Now hold on, let me. <laughs> Let him catch up. Me, please. So they can have a nice 10 minute conversation. Now, if you know I what I mean. Him. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Okay. And you're deputies now. <laughs> Something like that. As soon as we laid eyes on that fool of a sheriff who runs that town, I knew Dutch was going to play him like a fiddle. On the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Interesting. Hiding in plain sight, Dutch calls it. Hmm. <laughs> so, spirits seem good. In the new camp, I mean. We got some space between us and that mess now. Ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. There's these bounty hunters, of course, but Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Yeah, but they don't know that. Of course. Hold up a second. Why are you riding off on me? Everything's cool. So we got this. You was All right. Caravan. Uh-oh. Kind of addicted to this story right now. All right, here we go. Reckon it's that one with the fire outside. Let's take a look. <laughs> Yeah, this don't look so good. 
Alright guys, after looking with the eagle eye vision, the only things that really seem to be highlighted are the drawer right there, and then this bloody, I guess, rag, if you would. We'll check it out. There's some blood here. That ain't good. This was lit up, but I don't understand, like, what... Why would that be... See, it's still glowing. Hmm. Maybe there's something else. Let me look around the kitchen really quick. There's... Oh, so everything highlights anyway, so... Alright, so we got the bloody rag. Uh, there's a note right here. Hold on. I think after I search this, I'm supposed to go out there to him. Common stock? Alright. Mining company. Interesting. Okay. Uh, now we also have... Said there was a clue right here. Hold on. No clue. Looks like he was in the middle of eating, and all of a sudden just somebody broke in... All right, I think we're good. I'm not gonna take all this guy's stuff. Hey, all right, here we go. Girl. Mm. All right, oh, so we're going this way. All right, focus right on horse tracks. Here. How's your tracking these days? All right, I guess. Mm. Well, lead the way then. Not the kind of place I'd expect to see Trelawney staying in. No. Normally scams himself into the best hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean after the bar fight, I swear he talked the whole way and never actually said a damn thing. I thought you knew. That's his special talent. They could be 20 miles away by now. We can track them that far if we need to. Depends Wait. on how much you want to find them. Yeah. Where is it? Oh, it keeps going down here. I still ain't sure about that. See? They must have crossed over the tracks. Huh. They seem to head into the forest now. Little cut left right. Oh, we got, we got clues right there, too. We haven't actually had to use this in it since, like, the beginning of the game, it feels like. Hey, look. Let's go see what those fellas have to say. Alright, talk to the men. Excuse me. Yeah. Have you seen them? <clears throat> we're, uh, we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. Ah, <laughs> uh, you seen him. Strange sort of fella. Sort of formal. Strange. Sure. Formal. Nah. He uses a cane. Looks a lot like this one. Yeah. All right, you two. Where the hell is he? We both better get out of here. Come here. Oh, are you shitting me? Oh, my hat came off. No, you don't. Hey, one punch man over here. Watch out. All I wanted was competition. Well, he didn't need my hat. You I mean, help. It's that hat right when I saw that. Where is Trelawney? I don't know anything. Tell me where he is. You go to hell! You better tell me now, you son of a bitch! Okay! Okay, for Christ's sake! They took him to a cabin. Over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left! Down the path there by Braithwaite Manor. Um... I'm gonna release him. Let me see you again, you hear me? You got lucky there, my friend. Now, what if they lie, though? That's the thing. Like, what would stop them well, from actually lying? Is what I'm trying to get at. Like, I don't... I understand, like... Mm, let's get this. Two repeaters? I don't think we need that. Let's get the rifle. There we go. Let's go! Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. After you, then.
You okay? I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. Just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. Damn. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and, well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he talked, I'll goddamn find out what he said. If I'm not mistaken... Oh, hold on. Let me see what he says. Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. Learn that much. I mean, how much time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent. Keeping fish on the line. It's funny to think how much of the map we haven't even seen yet in this game. Like, it's ginormous. I think the fast traveling is going to help out down the road, but the fact is you have to do it from certain areas. So you actually have to get to the fast travel point for it to even matter, you know? We got to be getting close. That must be it. Oh, it's about to be a shitstorm. Hold on. We're gonna get jumped here. I got a feeling. Let's get you out of here. Come on, boy. The thing is, after that sack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so you're uh, alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry. They won't be for much longer. Okay, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. I knew I was gonna chase somebody down. I gotta do this on foot. Oh, he's running through the field. Hold on. Who knows what he told them? Let's get after those son of bitches. They're trying to hide in the fields. Where'd this guy go? He like ran through and disappeared like. Oh shit, we got bounty hunters. Like damn Kevin Costner in a field of dreams or some shit. Where's Stop the other guy? Hiding, Keep looking, Arthur. You must be eh, it's not gonna be over here. It's gotta be in the yellow. <laughs> what the hell? Oh shit! <laughs> He's mine! Let me take him. Let me get out of here. You have my friend. He's not your friend. I'll give you money. Be quiet. <laughs> Woo! That was supposed to happen. That's why I couldn't find that guy. Come on. You should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Oh, shit. Thank you. Oh, shit. We got more. The gunshots are coming. Come on! Where'd that guy go? He's backing off inside! Get after him! Somebody asked why I don't lock, like, I lock on with a dead eye, but I don't like mark a bunch of enemies. A lot of that's just because there's no reason to since most of the time it's one shot, one kill, but I, you know, I could, I guess. It didn't really matter. Good. You should be the last of them. <sighs> Alright, let's go back for Trelawney. What is this? A rare block yeah. rifle? Hold on. I wonder how... What's trouble he's brought with him? Uh, <laughs> guess we'll soon find out. Seems like we can't get... 
Good break now, Arthur. Our luck's held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so I heard. <laughs> sure. What's government agents and bounty hunters to us? Uh, I hope you're right. I'm gonna clean this really quick, but I'm pretty sure the, the lens is like super dirty. Come on. Let's not drag this out any longer. Oh, I can't. Oh, it's already clean anyway, so... It's supposed to just look like that. Alright, let's head on back. I don't know if it's because I was inside and trying to aim or what, but man, it was like... Let me show you. Oh, it's much better now. Okay. It said it's a rare gun, so... There's apparently really rare weapons you can get in this game. I don't know where they are. But I'm sure I'll find them eventually. It's probably something you do after you beat the game. Just something Mr. to look for, you know? Well, he's still here, at least. Put your feet up, why don't you? You okay? Never finer. So, who was they? Uh, they were bounty hunters. Uh, attached to Cole Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What you tell them? Not much. I told them I was an intellectual. Come down here from Oregon, looking for a job at the university. Of course, they didn't believe me. Seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. So I keep hearing. It might be best if I stay with you gentlemen for a while. Can't go back to that caravan now. All right, Charles, you take Trelawney back to camp, I'll catch up with you. Okay. There always seems to be more, more and more civilization. I want to get back in the open country of the West, or what's left of it, but well, even that ain't the way I remember it. Yo, I like when he sometimes talks like that. It's almost like an inner monologue where like he's actually thinking. You don't actually see that too often either. Now, let me see what this thing says. I, I bet you it's like, oh, in one minute, okay. That would have been easy had I actually uh, inspect all the clues. So I didn't get all the clues there. That's fine. Uh, well, so nothing really changed with the mission. We still saved the guy. It kind of worked out. Now we have oh, a spot God, where we could girl. actually fast travel if we wanted to. Let me see how far away the next mission is. Oh, it's back at camp. So it really wouldn't make any sense. Let me go over here and do this one. Since the other one's at camp, I can do that one when I go back and, like, rest. 